I'm, I'm, I'm sorry too, so sorry. So it's my fault, okay? I, I wasn't watching. Yeah. Yeah, I was just trying to book a ride. So sorry, please. It's okay. Um, you, you're in a hurry? You seem to be in a hurry. Oh, yes. Um, um you want me to give the ride? Oh, thank you. But I'll find my way, okay? Thank ah, you so ah, much. Come on, I don't bite. My name is Ethan. I just moved into the flat above your side, thing, so that makes me your neighbor. Oh, um, my name is <laughs> Nicole. Nicole, Nicole, yes. Wow. Mm -hmm. Beautiful name for a beautiful lady. Oh. You know, I plan to name my first daughter, Nicole. Come on. <laughs> Anyways, thank you for that uh, compliment. Thank you. Well, now that we've made acquaintance, how about I give you that right? Um. Come on. I just go back from the gym and I'll give you some company as well. Okay. Huh? Sure. Sure. <laughs> yes. Come thank on. you. Come on. <laughs> Here we are. Oh, yes. Um, thank you so much for taking the stress of driving me down here. Ah, come on, Faith. I will be offending Cupid and Athena if I let you go through all that stress or discomfort. <laughs> <laughs> come on, please. Just 
Stop it, okay? Just stop exaggerating this beauty thing. Akon, but it's true. You're beautiful. And I like to appreciate beauty. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Again. Yes. I appreciate, okay? Yeah. So what time do you close from work? Oh, uh, by 4 p.m. 4 but p.m. usually I stay till 5 p.m. before leaving the office. Okay. So have a wonderful day. Oh, you too. Thank you. Bye now. Yeah, bye. Okay. Be good. Be good. Okay. Look in your eyes, all I see is love so satisfying. Baby, you did bust my brain. No, baby, you did. I love you, I love you, I love you. Baby, you did bust my brain. No, yeah. I love you, I love you, I love you. Can nobody do me like you do? Can nobody do me like you do? Can nobody has appointed me to be your personal chauffeur. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow, then I must be the luckiest person on this planet Earth. That you are, my lady. Please come with me. Oh, thank you. You're thank welcome. you so much. How oh, wow. Oh, went well. Yes. Fantastic. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> oh, wow. I love you. Love you. I can't believe this. I can't believe it. Uh -huh. I came. Tell me I love you And I tell you I love you too Look in your eyes, baby I know what I see Don't let me go now You're everything I ever need Look in your eyes so satisfying Baby, you did bust my brain No, baby, you did I love you, I love you, I love you Baby, you did bust my brain No Hi Hi <laughs> Wow You know, asking you out Best decision I've made this year Come on, <laughs> don't stop it. It's true. Enough of the flattery. No, I'm not flattering you. It's a fact. Matter of fact, Beyonce has got nothing in me. <laughs> no, just stop it. Because you don't mean that. <laughs> I do. <laughs> stop it. Let's just start going to fight you in your mind. Oh, I rebuke the spirit of mind changing. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Yeah, good, okay. Let's go. <laughs> let's go after you. Hi. Listen, I um, I just want to say that I'm deeply sorry about what happened earlier today. I actually allowed my mind to take me beyond my limits. Come on, Nicole. If there was ever an offense in that, we were both guilty. Oh, no. No, you're not. 
Okay, you're not guilty of anything. All right? I mean, you were only trying to save me from falling and getting hurt. Well, stop torturing yourself. Moreover, I kind of enjoy the kiss. Even though it was for like a few seconds. <laughs> Ethan, listen. We both know that this is wrong. I mean, you have a girlfriend and you certainly will not leave her for me. Well, let me be the judge of that. Listen, I know what I'm talking about. A few years ago, I had a similar situation and that taught me a huge lesson. Well, let's talk about this when we see tomorrow. Okay, I just called to say that the kiss we shared was beautiful. I guess you are expecting a response from me. Why don't you go to bed and we show over that? Okay. Okay. If you say so. Have a good night. Good night. Tell me I love you. And I tell you I love you too. Look in your eyes. Stop it. Just stop it, Nicole. Stop blushing over another woman's man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, listen, mm -hmm. this is no flattery or anything. Okay. But, mm. oh my gosh, I can't remember the last time I had such a delicious homemade meal. Okay. Mm. <laughs> oh no, please just stop it. I'm serious. No, you're not serious. Uh -huh. You that I believe must have had a lot of beautiful and sophisticated women at your beck and call. Mm. Listen. No, I'm listening. The last time I had a decent homemade meal mm. was before Gloria traveled. Gloria. Yeah, Gloria just happens to be my ex. Oh, what about it though? Oh. So, why did you break up with her? Well, she got a scholarship to go and study her doctorate degree in the United States. I got a job attached to it. I pleaded with her to stay. I even offered to give her a monthly salary of 300,000 and she refused. Oh, wait a minute. 300,000 every month. Yeah. What kind of a woman would turn down such an amazing offer if she truly loves him? Well, Gloria was a career woman and a feminist as well. Okay. I know she loved me, but I guess she loved her. She loved that offer or career more. Okay. But okay. you're good. Enough of Gloria. Mm. You. Okay. Who taught you to cook so well? Oh, please, let me draw. I'm serious. My mother. Your mother? <laughs> she did a good job, right? She did. All right, thank you. I'm glad you enjoyed the meal. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Look here. What is it? Come here. Come here. I love Look at me. <laughs> Stop it. And I tell you I love you too. Look in your eyes, babe. I know what I see. Don't let me go now. You're everything I ever need. Look in your eyes.
Can nobody do me like you? Can nobody touch me the way you do? Can nobody hold me down like you? Baby, you did bust my brain oh. I love you, I love you, I love you Baby, you did bust my brain oh. We're sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time Baby, you did, you did bust my brain oh. Yes, I Hey Anna Sonki, to Anna Sonki, Zai, subscribing, I dial star there, the view, the more for in a sad, a turn, a hush. Nicole, <laughs> what a pleasant surprise. Oh, Raymond. <laughs> oh, oh my you. goodness. <laughs> so good to see you. Oh, same year. Oh. <laughs> Look at it's you. It's been a while. Yes, it's been. How have you been? Well, I've been trying to survive. Oh. <laughs> so what are you doing here? Uh, well, I, uh, I came to check on someone here. You mean here? Oh, yes, this building. Wow, wow. I mean, my cousin stays here. Oh, really? <laughs> I just stepped out from here now. Wow, good to know. Wow, good wow. Good to know. So good. Oh, yes. <laughs> so good to see you. <laughs> Same here. Wow. So, um, um, what are you standing here for? Oh, um, I'm, I'm trying to um, get a cab. <laughs> oh, oh, really? Yes. Okay. So, where are you going to? Um, um, Listen, I really don't know where I'm going to. I'm just confused. Nicole, what are you saying? Um, you just said you're here wanting to book a cab. I mean, I don't understand. What exactly is going on? Where are you going to? Raymond, is your friend Ethan. I've not spoken to him nor heard from him for the past one month now. Okay, wait, hold on. Um, which of the Ethans are we talking about? Is it my friend or someone else? Of course, your friend, Ethan. You see, the last time I saw Ethan was a month ago. That was before he traveled to Ghana for his meeting. It's so strange. Well, have you tried reaching him via phone? I've been doing that for the past 28 days now. His phone, his number is unreachable. That's the reason why I'm so worried. I really don't know what to do. No, just take, take it easy. Take it easy. You, you know what? Let's just let's step into the car and we we'll talk better. All right. Okay. All right. Sorry. I really can't believe this. You mean Ethan has the money to do this to me? What did I ever do wrong to him? It's okay, it's okay. <laughs> Raymond. Yes. Please. I would like to see him. I just want to see him face to face. Let him tell me what I did wrong. <laughs> I believe that Ethan has been in Nigeria for the past one month. So he blocked my number. <laughs> okay. 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 Could you help me with his house address? Could you just do it for me? Well, uh... But the way things stand now, 
I have no choice. But, but do me this favor. Please ensure he doesn't know I give you his address. Okay. So, stop crying. <laughs> It's okay, it's alright, it's alright. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay. It's alright. That's it, bro. Nicole. How how did you find this bed? Listen, why don't you go home and I'll come and see you? There's no need for this drama and all this, you know. Just 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 go home. This is true. Oh, this is... What? What is true? No, this this is Nicole. The lady oh, I... Nicole. The lady that got abandoned by your friend, right? Oh, sweetheart. I'm so sorry. I've been exactly where you are before. Some of those men are just assholes. Hmm? Why don't you come in for... Some water or something. No, no, she wants to come and see you. Look at her. She cannot be stressed or anything. Let me go. I'll come and see you uh, sometime this week, okay? You can come in. I will Maybe come a bottle of water is a... I'm so sorry. I feel so bad for her. Yeah. Your friend is such an asshole, really. Yeah. I don't understand you. Why would you break it from Clarice? Girl? What would you, what do you expect me to have done? Please, the boy, you're hanging on the street. Do not give her this dress. Oh, I don't believe you. Oh. Hi. Hey. Why are you two arguing so loudly? Um, we're just having a harmless argument. Okay, that didn't sound harmless to me, though. Yeah, where, where are you going to? I'm off to the supermarket. Okay. Anyways, I hope you two don't kill yourselves before I'm back. All right, bye, Raymond. All right, take care. Oh, no, you're not trying to pull me. You're not trying to pull me. So unbelievable. You're just, uh... And it's you can't just... smoke that shit here. This is not my old house. Will I just they walk you, Abby? Eh? You try and stop it. Try and stop it. I see if it's not better than that nonsense. That rubbish you steal. I don't blame you. Poor guy. Why, why do you give her my address? The least you could have done was at least warn me that she was coming. You know, sometimes you baffle. You do. I mean, I wonder how someone like you is deserving of, of this inheritance that your old man left. Oh, I don't deserve it, Abby. Maybe you should wake up the old man and get him to rewrite the will. Idiots. What are we saying? What are you saying? I mean, listen to yourself. I mean, you just proven how, how dumb you are. Wake up, who? Eh? Why well, not provoke me, this, Listen, the annoying thing is that since you knew you were not going to be serious with this lady, why did you get me involved? Why did you introduce her to me in the first place? Now, the poor thing will think that I'm in on, on, on your deeds. Yeah, that's your own personal business, yeah? In fact, good for you, Seth. I hope she thinks so. Ethan. Ethan. <laughs> Your eye goes so clear. Hmm? Your eye goes so clear. By the time this reckless lifestyle of yours that I'm warning you about, that I'm warning you against, by the time it's Bobby Ranks, now that's how your eye goes clear. Nonsense. You can choose wife for me now. Nicole, look at you. You can't keep going on this way. Comfort yourself. But what wrong did I ever do to Ethan to deserve this kind of treatment? Listen, no one knows what happened that made him treat his mind towards you. No, no, Raymond. He didn't change his mind about nothing. This has always been the plan from the start. Oh, listen, why did you put yourself to How do you concentrate on working? You continue this way. What of what use is the job to a dead person? 
Now listen. I need you to put yourself together. He promised me. Inca doesn't deserve this kind of attention you give it to him. <sighs> mm. Raymond. Yes. Can I ask you a question? Please do. Have you ever been in love? Babe, this is something that's going to benefit the both of us. I'm trying to make you see princess with me here. I thought we've gone past this. I thought so too, which is exactly why I'm perplexed that you're even bringing this up again. Listen, what is there in the States that we can get here in Nigeria? You know you're being really selfish right now, right? I mean, you can't relocate to the States with me, but you expect me to stay here? Look, we have a business here. We own a business here, okay? The business is ours. If we go to the state, we'll be working for other people. We can sell the business, babe. The business can be sold, you relocate with me, and then we reinvest the money. You know, sometimes I think all these degrees you've had has kind of numb your thinking faculty. Excuse me? What the heck is that supposed to mean? How can I make you understand this? The company? It's my family's heritage. Then stay back and preserve your family heritage. But don't expect me to stay with you. Seriously? Yeah, seriously. What's up with you and this year old me? And by the way, you know, try. I mean, you were seated right here and you were making me knock. Knock endlessly. What's up? If I didn't open the door. And how did you get inside? What is this up? My house no drive me come out though. What is it? Uh, by the way, where's Gloria? I noticed uh, absent. She has gone back to the States. Do you trust the States? Um Abekuta or no, Abuja State. Well, respect yourself, bro. I can't know. Ah, what is it? Okay, um, Mawito, I thought you said uh, she's back for good. What's up? I thought so as well. Mm -hmm. Obviously, my dreams and hers didn't align. That bitch wanted to sell my father's company or my company. And then pack up everything and relocate to the States with her. Hold on, hold on. I didn't get that last part. Uh, you selling your company. <laughs> oh, wow. I mean, that lady is such an amazing one. <laughs> I come to think of it, she tried. Absolutely. A wonderful advice it was. Trust me. Isn't it your life in that, Abby? <laughs> No, I don't blame you. Now. I blame myself because I'm the one. I'm the one. I'm, I'm the one talking to you now, telling you. That's why, you know. Even though I don't see why you'd be laughing at me. Well, shut up, Joe. Oh, I cannot play with you. Idiot. <laughs> but wait, there. Uh, see, eh? Uh, on a more serious note, don't think I will be there for you to go beg the call. Young man, don't do it. That's the truth. Beg Nicole for what? Oh boy, never. Never, ever would I return back to any of my exes. It can't work. Never. No. Please. <laughs> Please. Are we going to sit in the hall then? Huh? Why? I'm going to change. What I need right now is a cold beer. Please, you do. You do you get out of this crazy mood. Hmm? Oh, come on. Don't you, why don't you stay in your house? Why must you always come to mine? <laughs> Please move that. <laughs> but really, on the most serious, you just to think about that advice. I mean, the lady means well. Mm -hmm. right. <laughs> Ethan, my friend. Tell me I love you. And I tell you I love you too. Look in your eyes. What I
Now you're a joker. Oh. Mm. God damn it. Ah. What's it? I think that lead over there is flirting with me. What lead? One in the red dress. Far end? <laughs> uh -uh. Who you playing? Look here. <laughs> Look ah, yeah, here. yeah. You know, I do tell you, I am not a party to this one, seriously. Oh boy, I beg. Now you're a bad lady, bro. Maybe. Yeah, thank you. Oh boy. That's my cue. Mm. And I am not definitely losing out on this parade, trust me. Really? Yeah. yeah. So, you know, you even have names for that parade. <laughs> oh boy, just mind your own business now. Mm. Uh, what's, with the, what's with the lectures? Down. Hello. Hi. You are the lady that sent the bottle of wine to my table. Yes, I am. Thank you. Alejo. Alejo Alde. And in case you're wondering what it means, it means God's gift. Wow. And not only beautiful, woman with brains as well. <laughs> Thank you. My name is Ethan. I am the CEO of Ninja Brokers Limited. Ethan. D. Ethan. Stock exchange. Genius Ethan. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Listen. Woo. Ah, come off it. I'm not all that genius the media points me out to be. Mm -mm. You don't have to be humble. I have read a lot about you. You're truly a genius. You can tell that to other people, but not me. You've read about me? Mm -hmm. Why? <laughs> well, there was a time I intended to break into the stock exchange market after oh. I took over my father's company. So I did a lot of reading to get acquainted with the sector, and your name kept popping up. Ethan, I love you, Ethan. Ah. All right, just pump your brakes a bit. I mean, <laughs> what do you do for a living? Well, how about we discuss that over lunch? 
say tomorrow? How can I say no to that? You know, you have me falling over you already. So, lunch it is tomorrow? Lunch definitely it is, but I will have to have your number to be able to call you, you know, right here. There you go. Thank you very much, and I will call you. I'll look forward to your call. Oh, I look forward to it too. You have a great day. You're everything I <laughs> ever need. Look in your eyes. All I see is love so satisfying. Baby, you did bust my brain. I love you, I love you, I love you, baby. You did bust my brain. I think I. I have a little malaria. You're putting it off. Why do you call this a little malaria? Um, what about a uh, pharmacy? No, 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 no. You know, I won't be a part of that. That's self-medication. I know it's dangerous. Let, let, let me get you to the hospital. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I hate hospitals. Okay, how about I call my doctor then? Okay. Okay. Hello, Doc. Yes. Uh, please, I'll need you to come to my friend's place as soon as possible, sir. Yeah, definitely. I'll send you the address right away. Thank you very much. Uh, Raymond, thank you so much. Sorry. Thank you. Okay, I, I truly appreciate everything you're doing for me. Thank you so much. Nicole, it's the least I can do. May God bless you. But Nicole, I mean, we can't keep going on this way. We can't keep going on about this this way. Okay. okay. <laughs> I'm sure you can't remember the last time you went to the office. <sighs> that statement would have been valid if it was directed to someone that still has a job. What do you? Tell me I love you And I tell you I love <laughs> you were going to tell me what you did for a living. Hmm. So? And there I thought you did forgotten about that. Forgotten about it? I don't think so. What do you do for a living? Well, earlier I told you my name, but it seems it did not ring a bell. I'm sorry. Um... Doesn't ring a bell. My head is always full, <laughs> I guess. It's okay, it's no offense. My name is Elijo Arudu, the only surviving daughter of late Dr. Arudu Adicho. The oil and gas business mogul of blessed memory? Mm -hmm. Wow! <laughs> Who would have thought that? It's you! Life in flesh and humbly at your service. <laughs> well, I feel honored to be in your presence right now. Oh, please stop it. <laughs> I am an icon's daughter, but you, you are an icon yourself. So I am the one that is humble. Really? Well, I will take that any day. <laughs> you are a very beautiful lady. Thank you. Hello. Oh, um, I get to share something with you. Oh, I hope it's not bad news because you know you are the bearer of bad news all the time. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> Come here, it's like. Shut up, Joe. <laughs> no. Well, it's actually good news. It is. 
Mm. Yeah, what is it? Well, I've just been transferred to our new office in Egypt. No, that is great news. Congratulations. Thanks. Jeez. Thanks. Cheers to that. Oh, definitely. Uh-uh. Yeah. They had the branch. Yes, I mean, it came as a shock to me too. But... It is the only way to give us you the game. I'm just saying, you know what, it's good. No, you're all right. You're saying well. So, congratulations. Well, thank you very much. I'll be traveling in the next two weeks. Damn, two weeks. Mm -hmm. You should celebrate, you know. Definitely. Go out on pad, not just drinking it. Go out on party hard. <laughs> you got two weeks of that. Of course, of yeah. course, of course. <laughs> um, but that's not what's paramount on my mind right now. You see. That's paramount on your mind. It's okay. paramount on the mind of the man who's been to Egypt for two weeks to hell. Was you joke with everything? I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <sighs> what is it? It's that girl. What girl? Cool. Oh no, 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 don't do that. No, that's past. We 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 move past that. You can't keep bringing back the past. Listen, what's wrong with listen you? Every time you call, uh, why? Listen to me, let me talk. Listen, gosh. See, are you aware that the lady lost her job because of what you did to her? Listen, all I am saying is try to make amends with her. I mean, before she commits suicide, I mean, for posterity's sake, please. Look, it's fine. I'm just busy at the moment, that's all. I'm trying to make time with you. You're busy? Yeah. With a bottle of wine? It takes a lot for a bottle of red wine. You can come in, the door is open. All right. Hey, Raymond. How are you? I'm very well. Good to have you. Good to have it. Noodles. <laughs> you guys have some with me. <laughs> Good to have you here. Oh, thank you very much. Um, care to join me? Ah, looks so tiny, but I'll pass. It is nice, actually. <laughs> I'll pass. Thanks. Okay. Thank you. Look at you. You're looking good. Mm hmm. Do I have a choice? <laughs> oh well. Um. You know, I definitely have to put everything that happened in the past. Because obviously, your friend Ethan has moved on. And I need to do the same. Hmm. Well, that's good to hear. Thank you. Well, I was going to ask how you're holding up, but look at you. <laughs> you're doing well. Thank you. Ah, well, I have an advice to share with you. Okay. How about having a friend, a relative, I mean, someone who can come stay with you, depending on the time you bounce back from it. Oh, well, that is actually very nice. That's the least I can do. Thank you for always having me your thoughts. <laughs> yeah, thank you. <laughs> well, um, Already I spoke with a friend of mine, and as we speak right now, she is on her way from Calabar. Really? Mm -hmm. Well, that's great news. <laughs> Thank you. Wow, that's good, that's good. Uh, well, that's it all stacked. Um, I equally have another great news to share with you. A good one. A good one. <laughs> I like good news. <laughs> Who doesn't like good news? I wonder. Okay, so um, this is it. Okay. I have just been promoted. Mm -hmm. Now wait for it, that's not it. Okay. I've just been transferred to Egypt uh, to head our new branch there. Oh. That's that's exactly how I felt when I heard the news too. <laughs> Egypt? 
Egypt. I mean, I I never saw it coming. I mean, I just got the news and oh, uh -huh. I found it. Oh, um, uh, uh, so, I'm happy for you. <laughs> thank you, and um, that means I'll be moving pretty soon, anytime. You know, that is um, a big one for you. Yes, it is. I'm super excited. I have. Thank you, Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> uh, at least I'm happy that mm. you're, you're getting out of this mood. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Um, <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm happy for you. <laughs> Thank you wow. so much. Wow. Look in your eyes. All I see is love, so sad I'm going to so miss you. I'm going to miss your constant nagging. Oh, really? Your constant getting in my face. <laughs> okay, you call a brother being another brother. Uh, watching in the back of another brother Oh, nagging. shut up. I mean, come on. Fine. I miss you. I watch your back. I miss you a lot of good reasons. <laughs> I mean, for some reason, I'm just feeling anxious about the trip. Really. I know. You're flying out tomorrow. Tomorrow, this time tomorrow, you'll be on your way. Of course. This time next tomorrow, you'll be in Egypt. Live and direct. <laughs> we can always come visit you. No, I certainly would. Of I'll course. find some time. I'll come out there. Definitely. I want to see what Egypt is like. Better not go get any woman pregnant there. Anyway. That's supposed to be directed at you. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> Excuse you. <laughs> Sorry. Oh. Hello? How are you doing, darling? Oh, yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm good. Oh, yes, yes. Uh, yeah, just like I told you, okay? In um, four, five, max, six months, uh, you'll be coming over. Yeah, I told you everything will be fine. Well, come on, it's nothing, it's the best I can do. I mean, if I have the chance, I would even do more. Uh -uh. <laughs> yes, yes, tomorrow. So, oh, thank you. All right, all right. <laughs> oh, oh God, who the new catch? Hmm? And in six months, you'll be flying out. Are you serious? Who are you saying? My darling, Ethan. It's none of your business. Who's your darling? Come on, get out. <laughs> I mean, respect yourself. <laughs> oh, mm. Egypt, here I come. Well, good luck, bro. <laughs> I wish you well. <laughs> Thanks. Oh. So, have you organized your place? Where are you going to be staying? Yeah, that's, um, it's been sorted. Mm. Yes, it is. Try, of course. You got a car there? Yeah, of course. Everything. You want to me around, right? <laughs> Most definitely. We just <laughs> give it some months and come over. Good morning. <laughs> I hope you had a beautiful night's sleep. Mm -hmm. You did? I cannot remember the last time I slept this good. But I'm glad. I'm also glad that I'm waking up to you. Mm. Mm. Well, I hope this afternoon to regret it. Well, you took the words right out of my mouth. I never say this to anyone, not anytime soon. Hmm. Hmm. What are you talking about? Well, we'll talk about it over breakfast, okay? Hmm? 
well, if this is your way of avoiding the topic, mm. rest assured I don't forget easily. <laughs> don't worry. It's mm. good. And like I said, we'll talk about it over breakfast. Okay, you win. <laughs> <laughs> Mm-hmm. And then you said I took the words right out of your mouth. Yes, I did. The truth is, I have never felt like this for anyone. Except Gloria, though. Where's Gloria? Well, Gloria is my ex. We were so in love. I thought we were going to get married. If you were so in love, why did you split? Well, I guess I placed more value in her than she placed on me. Hmm. Now that's some deep talk right there. You know, we went out for years in the States. And when my parents died, I came back to take care of the family business. And she, staying in this country wasn't part of her plan. But settling in this country is not such a bad idea, considering you have the finance to live whatever kind of life that you desire. Yeah, she was of the opinion that if I loved her enough, then I would sell up everything and relocate to America. <laughs> Now, why would you do that? Mm. Your parents would not be happy with you wherever they are. My point exactly. I tried to make them understand that, but all that fell on deaf ears. Now, that's pathetic. Mm. Well, I guess we've all had a fair share of sad love and relationship. But right now, what I feel for you is more than I have felt for her or any other boy. Tell me I love you. And I tell you I love you. I guess there's a reason God wanted us to meet each other. Your eyes, baby. I know what I see. The reason why I fired the previous manager here was his inability to work effectively. Okay? Yes. Sir. I don't like people running down my business. You know, so I need you to do your best. Yes, sir. Any complaints? I need to know. Okay? Okay, sir. Any carpentry work, any plumbing, whatever. Yes, I need to know. Yes, sir. You understand? Yes, sir. All right. You're on probation. This is three months. After that, I will know if I'm going to make, a, make you a permanent star. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Thanks. Take care. Hello, my beautiful. Uh, I just came to one of my service apartments. I fired my previous manager. I got somebody else, hopefully a competent one. Yeah. I'm a bit stressed out. Listen, I'm heading to the office at the moment. Um, I should be done in about an hour. So when I'm done, I'll 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 come back home. What are you making, baby? Anything you're making, I will eat because it's from you, and I am with you. All right, baby. I will see you in about an hour. Okay. Bye. I love you. Okay. Babe. I want to ask you something. What is it? I want to ask you. You're moving with me. I wasn't expecting that. Well, I want you to be the first person I see when I wake up. And the last person I see before I go to bed. I am a shot of words. Mm. 
my past relationships has been a script being played out. They all wanted my wealth. That's the reason I don't trust any women. Let alone, they don't see it. So what is different now? The difference is that I know that you are not after my money and you have nothing left. Hey, good day, sir. Good day. How may I help you? I'm Barista Liu. I'm Ilya just after me. She asked me to prepare a document for her and she gave me this address to deliver it that she'd be out of her place for a while. Yeah, she now stays here. Um, but she, she's not around though. Uh, then I guess you're going to have to keep it for her then. Yeah, um, but she won't be long. Why don't you come in and wait for her? I really wish I could. Uh, you know, duty calls. Okay, I will take that and I'll make sure she gets it. Do enjoy the rest of the day. Thank you, and you too. <laughs> she barely knows me, and she's willing her assets to me. In your eyes, all I see is love so satisfying. Baby, you didn't bust my brain, no. I love you, I love you, I love you, baby. You didn't bust my brain, no. I love you, I love you, I love you. Can nobody do me like you? Can nobody touch me the way you do? Can nobody hold me down like you? You are one of a kind, oh, baby. Oh, baby. You didn't bust my brain, no. I love you, I love you, I love you, baby. You didn't bust my brain, no. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, baby. You did, you did bust my, my brain. brain. Oh. Yes, I, I love you, I love you, I love you. You did bust my brain. Yes, I. Oh. I love you. Are you, are you okay? You look lost. I'm not drinking. Come and eat. Let's go. <laughs> mm, now you're eating this now, not me. Okay. <laughs> mm. Sit down. Hey, Raymond. Hello, how are you? I'm very well, thank you. Thank you. Uh, of course, you know, I have to be happy. And my friend always tells me that happiness is free. Oh, uh, well, uh, absolutely true. Mm, absolutely true. <laughs> Anyways, um, how is Egypt treating you? <sighs> I need not to ask too many questions because you are glowing. Mm. <laughs> I, I, I don't know about that one. I don't. Uh -uh. <laughs> All right, a quick one. Uh, Nicole, um, I know you should have an international passport. But what I don't know is if it's still valid. Oh, uh, well, I, I don't think so. I remember it expired a uh, few months ago. Okay, okay. Um, I'll need you to do something. Send me your account details, okay? And um, I'll send you some money so you can get it renewed. Thank you so I will do exactly as you said. I'm asking why I'm in need of your international passport. Mm. I need to be for my good. Uh, exactly. Okay, so um, I need you to get yourself prepared because you'll be coming to Egypt 
in the next three months. Uh, Raymond, I, I am short of words right now. I, 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 I really don't know what to say. Don't say anything, okay? <laughs> All right, how about your friend? Um, see me well tomorrow. I think I should do great. I should do great on you, okay? I'll talk to you later, okay? Bye. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Bye. Thank you. <sighs> Thank you, Raymond. Breakfast will be ready in a few minutes. Mm. Hmm. I'm going to have to grab something on the way. I have some foreign investors waiting for me in the office. Okay? All right. You look like a groom. You're going to me up. But no kisses. Oh, I'm sorry, darling. I'll see you later, okay? See you, babe. All right. Hello? Hello, good afternoon. Mm -hmm. Good afternoon. Is this Elijah Aude? Oh yes, this is Elijah Aude. I'm calling oh. from the general hospital. The individual to come and I'm referred. An accident is saying that I am pregnant. Yeah, what happened? What, where, where, what happened? Hello? Hello? Good afternoon. I got a call from the hospital uh, about an accident victim, Ethan. His name is Ethan Alavi. Oh, you're Mrs. Elodie. Yes. Okay, wait. Let me just talk to the doctor. Um, madam, um, you would have to calm down. Um, the accident uh, caused uh, one or two fractures on his uh, cervical spine. And uh, we noticed also, of which we've treated him, um, we have things under control, okay? Uh, also, the one or two fractures around his uh, ankle, but you just have to calm down, okay? Uh, uh, please, can I see him? Yes, yes, of course, you can see him. Um, but just, okay, uh, all right. Look in your eyes, all I see is love so satisfying. Baby, you did bust my brain, no. Don't worry. He's in good hands. We'll take very good care of him. Bust my brain, no. Yeah. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. Can nobody do me like you? Nurse, please come with me. Can nobody touch me the way you do? Can nobody hold me down like you? You are one of a kind, oh, baby. baby. You did bust my brain. Hello. Good afternoon, sir. Yeah, I have heard a lot about you as well. How is Egypt treating you? It's true. We are at Nizamiya Hospital. It's one of the best hospitals in the country.
No, that's not a problem. It's covered. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much. Mr. Eaton, uh, since you have decided you want to go home, uh, in as much as I would prefer you stay one or two weeks for us to at least monitor you for some time, please, you will do something for me. You avoid stressful work. Nothing, no work, just rest and rest peace. And if he tries anything, anything close to work, please don't hesitate to call me. And then when you notice any discomfort, you get pains, just call me. Please. Sure. I'll give All him right. a close marking. All right, good one, good one. Thank you very much. Thank you, Doctor. Yeah, come on. <laughs> you paid good money for the services we rendered. Right yeah. I'll get the nurse to come in here and uh, finalize things with you. Please uh, do. Uh, Thank you very much, Doctor. You're welcome. You're welcome. Good morning, handsome. Uh, good morning, my darling. Did you sleep well? Yes, I did. Even though you hardly slept. Mm, no, I did. I slept very well. While you were sleeping, I looked at you and you looked very peaceful and handsome. And I said to myself, I must sleep too and join you in your dreams. Mm. That should have been. Of course. I am going to try and hire a carer today. Carer? Why do you need a carer? Look, I'm going to be stuck in that chair for a couple of months. And I don't expect you to get, take care of me every day, all day. I am not complaining. Yes, I know. But you've got your business to take care of. My business is fine, okay? I got that sorted out. A friend of mine will help me out until things get back to normal. I just want to be considerate. There is nothing to be considerate about. Okay? We are fine. Okay. I'm coming. Okay. Something. Oh. Oh. Okay. Yes, hello. How are you? Mm -hmm. Okay, bye. Okay, big man, time for you to... Where did that smile go? What is wrong? My company just called. My office just called and... Mm -hmm. No business, no office talk, okay? You need to get better. Maybe you haven't heard what I was going to say. Okay. What I was going to say is that my assistant called to update me on the fact that my board of directors 
have passed a vote of no confidence in me and won me out as CEO of my own company. Uh, why would they do that? Can they do that? I know who's behind this. My dad's friend, who happens to be also a shareholder in my company. No, that is so unfair. It's okay. I'm sorry. What, what can we do? <laughs> Don't worry. I know how to deal with them. After all, you're my father's son. Yes, you are your father's son. Okay, Mr. Father's son, time to eat. Yes. Light breakfast. Ooh, breakfast in bed. For my king. Yes, you. Again. You deserve breakfast in bed all the time, every morning. You're going to do this every morning? Yes, I will do it every morning. For a few months? Forever. Let's see how long you will take before you get tired. Tired. Okay. I think I'll just settle for this. You don't have to worry about that. No bread. No okay, more. it's hot. Be careful. Mm. Baby, is that you? Yes, big man. Hey, my baby's home. H how did you get off your wheelchair? Babe, come on. It's just from here to here. Just from there to here. Mm -hmm. I think I'm strong enough to move yeah. myself. Yeah. The baby's strong, like Tyson. Yeah, baby. <laughs> I'm strong. I'm guessing now. Oh, but I didn't give you weight enough. So no, I've actually had myself bast in CNN. Mm. So now it's CNN over me. Never. In fact, CNN, off. I win. You'll always win. <laughs> well, now that I'm here. Now that you're here. What would you like for lunch? I want for lunch. Mm. I want all this. Stop playing, Fatty. I'm serious. And I'm serious, too. <laughs> and while we're at it, I want you to take that, have a look at it, and sign it. What is this? Just open the envelope and look at what is in it. You always have something up your sleeve, don't you? It's true. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> What, what is this supposed hey, to be? Hey, babes, come now. You don't have to get all walked up. So. You are signing 50% of your shares at your company to me. Yes. What are you trying to prove? I am not trying to prove anything. You see, the board of directors of my company wants to take it over. The only way I can keep it intact is by doing this. No, babe. We can think of another idea. You know, I cannot go to work. With you there, you be, you be my eyes and ears. I am comfortable. I am here recovering. I trust you, that much. Come on, I trust you. I promise you, I will not let you down. I know you won't. I promise you. Yeah. Come eat me some sugar. Mm. But now yeah. you have to eat. We can, can talk this. about this later. I can have this. No, you can't have this. All this. this. No, you can't have Oh my this. gosh. No, you have You're food. killing me. Food, so you recover. I know, it's and my get dessert. Strong and strong. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Stop. You're killing me. I am home, big man. Oh, baby, please come, 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 come. I am itching to hear all the details that happened in the board meeting today. Mm. Mm. You? Uh -huh. will not believe what you did last night. Mm. You were shocked for call. And I would have paid anything hmm. to see your face. <laughs> your dad's friend. Yeah. He had the worst look. Man was shocked. Was red with anger. <laughs> so my lobster, are you okay? Please, baby. Continue, continue. I've got to get the full details of this, please. Come on. Okay. Come. Well, please, I gotta hear it. Please. Oh, don't worry about me. I'll be fine. Well, just tell me. We started with exciting. Uh-huh. They said everyone should introduce yourself. Mm. But when it got to my turn, huh, the lawyer stood up and introduced me as the new CEO of the, the company. company. <laughs> I can imagine. I can only imagine the disappointment. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> well, the documents went round, round, round. It uh -huh. came back to me. Yeah. And I told everyone that they're going to receive a copy in their mailbox. Mm. Baby, we did it. We did we it. We saved your company. <laughs> I am so proud of you. Uh -huh. I don't know what I'd have done with you in here. You, my darling. How would you know? It's official. But you know you deserve it. You deserve this and more. I got you. And that's probably all I know. Mwah. Oh, okay. I, I would stay here and stare at you all day, but I need to go change. You do too. Then come back and pick me. Oh, I can wait for that. I can <laughs> tell me I love. I'm right here. You. All right, my love. I'm waiting. And I tell you <laughs> I love you too. Look in your eyes, babe. I know what I see. Don't let me go now. You're everything I ever need. Look in your eyes. All I see is love so satisfying. You look breathtaking. Wow. You, I will always cherish. Will you marry me? Look in your eyes. All I see is love so satisfying. Yes. Baby, you did bust my brain. No, baby, you did. I love you, I love you, I love you, baby. You did bust my brain. No, yeah. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. Can nobody do me like you? Can nobody touch me the way you do? Can nobody hold me down like you do? <laughs> hey, sweetness. You're always working. Mm. Yes, I love what I do. Busy, busy, man. Yeah. Hmm. So what are we doing? Forget yeah, what I'm doing. I want to ask for a favor. Mm, okay, absolutely. You know I would do anything for you. Okay. It's my birthday next week. Yep, and I am seriously preparing for that day. But there's something I want, and I hope you don't refuse. Okay. So I need to ask for my own birthday present. Mm -mm. Nope, that is not fair, and that is not happening. Your presence is a surprise. My surprise. I know, baby, I know. But this will mean the world to me. Okay? It'll be the best gift ever. Okay. Okay. What do you need? I want you to introduce me to your family members so I can do the needful. That will be my present. Oh, as you know, I'm the only surviving daughter of my parents. And I'm not exactly close to my extended family. We fought a lot. About the estates, the properties, the family business. But I do have a friend. Well, I wouldn't call her a name. She's more like a sister to me now. And I guess she's the only family that I have. And I would like to introduce her to her. I know she would love to meet you. Yeah. And I would love to meet you as well. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. And hey, don't worry. I will be your family, your papa, your mama, every Look member. In your eyes, all I see 
is not so satisfying, baby. This is beautiful. I love it. I know you would love it. Thank you very much. But my love, while this is all nice and beautiful, I want it with your family. Mm -hmm. You promised. Well, like I said, you deserve more. You get this, a wonderful dinner, and you also get to meet my family. Just be patient. I'm sure she'll be here. Okay. <laughs> you know what? Let me go call. Oh, there she is. <laughs> oh, hello there. Happy birthday, Ethan. <laughs> oh, well, I'm here to celebrate with you. <laughs> well, have a seat, my darling. Oh, thank you. She's the family member you were talking about. Uh, uh, Jesus! Stop! What is wrong with this girl? What is wrong with you? Are you blind or something? My darling, watch your head. <gasps> you scared me. What happened? What is wrong? Why would you walk so carelessly on the road? You weren't looking, you weren't listening. It's Ethan. Ethan, who, 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 is, who is Ethan? I can't believe Ethan did this to me. What did he do? <laughs> Stop, stop, stop. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, my love, it's okay. It's okay. I'm so sorry. Oh, just stop crying, my love. Stop crying, please. Don't worry, I'll take you home, okay? Okay? okay. When we get home, we can talk about it. Just stop crying. Um, driver, let's go, let's go. Good evening, Saji. I need you to reschedule my travel arrangements. Now it's your father notice. Uh, 
And her why? Why are you postponing your trip? I thought you told me on phone that you're spending just a week. Well, changing plans. After my parents' death anniversary and the Thanksgiving, I'll be hanging around for a little while. Well, you know that is not good for business. You need to go back and take care of your business yourself. Nicole, I cannot believe that you of all people would fall in love with a man. Enough for him to treat you like trash. Hmm? I really don't know why I felt so cheaply for Ethan. Why is this near you? Such a crybaby. You cry over every little thing. That is sick and pathetic. And that is why he kept treating you like a piece of shit. <laughs> Well, it's uh, it's okay. I'll be fine. Okay, I'll get over this soon. It's my mistake, and I just have to deal with it myself. Yeah. I'll be fine. I'll, I'll be okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, I saw his picture on your phone. You wouldn't believe what I discovered. Then, what could that be? Remember my friend? The one I told you committed suicide? Yes. Well, he's the same scumbag that dumped her and led to her death. Ethan? Oh, no, so this is his usual lifestyle then. Don't worry, he doesn't know what is coming for him. <laughs> when I am done with him, he wouldn't know what he did. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Hey babe. Mm. I've been meaning to ask you something. Okay, Axan, what is it? How do you intend to make Ethan pay for all his crimes? <laughs> well, don't worry your pretty head about that. I'll handle it. I will make him wish for that. Um, listen, whatever you do, please, don't kill him. Hmm. I don't want his blood on my hands. You see why this fool took advantage of you? Here you are pleading for his life. He made you lose your job, girl. Fuck hell. Listen, it's not that I don't know all this. And I'm not pleading for him. It's just that I don't want his blood to be on my hands. Please, just understand me. If I kill him, I did be doing him a favor. I want him alive. Breathing and wretched. I do not want any mistakes. I need you to do this job exactly as I asked you to. Come on, Biganti. If I wasn't good at my job, your contact wouldn't have referred you to me. Hmm. Well, that's true. Okay. What bank do you use? Universal Bank. Universal Bank. Account number? 321. Okay. 400. 400. 5491. 5491. Okay, sent. All right. I just sent 100,000 to you. When you do the job and do it well, and do it well, <laughs> then I'll send the balance. 
I'm sure you're going to top it up when you get the reports for the job. <laughs> Trust me. Keep me posted. All right, I will. Now tell me, sentiment aside, if you were a board member of Netflix, wouldn't you spend millions of dollars to buy this movie? I thought you said you loved me. No. I loved you, Ethan. When Jennifer loved you, right before she killed herself because of you, I found her lying in the pool of her own blood with a letter that has your name written all over it. <clears throat> I am still talking. I told you, you deserve this and more. More pain, more heartbreak, more agony than my friends ever felt. No wonder how many women had to suffer at your hand. So all this was just to get revenge back on you? All this was to watch you suffer. More than my friends ever did. What did you do with my company? Well, I guess hell knows no fool like a woman's cold. I asked you a question. What did you do with my company? If you don't get your hands off me right now, you will have a dozen soldiers ripping your head off. Check it. Good news. So my agent was able to pull some strings and he got us the tickets. We're leaving the country first thing tomorrow morning. 6.30 a.m. Sharp! <laughs> Girl, why aren't you excited? Um, can I ask you a question? Okay, what is it? Listen, I need you to be forthcoming with me, okay? Did you sell his company to his uncle? Well, yes, I did. He needed to suffer. I wanted him to pay for everything that he did to you and he did to my friend. He cost you everything. My friend lost her life because of him. He had to suffer. I needed him to feel that pain. And I don't regret it. Everything I had to do, all the sacrifices I had to make. I don't regret it one bit. The fact remains that he is suffering. And he's going to suffer for a very long time. But I promise you, I did not spend one dime of that money. I gave it all away. To charity. To the foundations that needed it. 
Okay. Okay, but the thing is sorry, let me get the call. Hey Raymond, how are you? Oh, you're coming back tomorrow. Oh, by 4 p.m. Oh, I see. I see. Ah, uh, ah, that is a little bit hard for me. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Ray. Yes, because first thing tomorrow, I'll be leaving the country. No, no, it's fine. Yeah, I'm. I'm sorry. Just please be good. Okay, take care of yourself. Yeah, I'll. I'll call you. Bye. Okay, I'm not gonna ask you what that was. All I care about is that we are leaving this country. We are starting afresh. We're gonna get a better life, meet someone else, <laughs> fall in love, and live our dream. And that is all we should care about. Be excited for that. So, my dear, UK, here we come. <laughs> Ethan. Ethan. What's this? What's this? Oh. Oh, stop, 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 stop. No, no, no. No. What? Stop. What's wrong with you? What is wrong with you? This is the nice thing to do. Why? Why? This is... Oh, God. God. Ethan, no, 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 no. This shouldn't be the next thing to do now. Oh, what if I didn't come in at this time? I can only imagine what you're going through right now. But this, this isn't the right way to go about it. Yes, I know you've lost it all. But you still have that one precious thing. That one thing that means more than all that you've lost. It is your life. So why want to take it? Why? Finn. Listen. I'm sure you, you're familiar with that saying that when there is life, there is hope. You've done it before. And I know you can do it again. You can bounce back on your feet again. With God and friends. Please. 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 <laughs>
And I tell you I love you too. Look in your eyes, babe. I know what I see. Don't let me go now. You're everything I ever need. Look in your eyes, all I see is love. So satisfying. Baby, you did bust my brain. No, baby, I love you, I love you, I love you. My brain, no. Yeah. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. Can nobody do me like you? Can nobody touch me the way you do? Can nobody hold me down like you? You are one of a kind, baby. Oh, baby. You did bust my brain, no. I love you, I love you, I love you, baby. You did bust my brain, no. Oh.